I wanted to also say is that you know self care doesn't have to be something that's grandiose.、Uh, doesn't necessarily mean doesn't necessarily mean that you have to do a big vacation. It could be a staycation, and you know through various conversations that I have with people today, it's like it could be something really basic, really small. Whether it's like taking your lunch breaks, taking care of your nutrition, making sure you sleep at the same time each night, making sure you get enough hydration. Um, make, you know, talking to people, doing your favorite things, maybe doing some of those tech tech detox, like shutting off the computer, shutting off your cell phone, and just disconnecting. Maybe reading, exercising, or even just taking five minutes out of your day. Maybe if something gets really stressful, taking those five minutes, take a step back, go out, do some people watching, go out and get grab some sunlight, grab a short walk before you re. Engage、um, that those are you know people don't think about it, but those are self care methods,、um, and I I used to not be <laughs> not really good with that. My thing is like I I had a, I had a really high expectation of my work performance and my like how I can contribute because I feel like my my value my worth is really how much I can contribute to things, but I think. We can't think of it this way. I think we all intrinsically have value.、Um, you, we don't necessarily have to like oh produce, produce, produce in order to have value. I think human life itself has value. God gave us value. I think in recognizing that, in recognizing that,、uh, you know, we're on this planet、uh, to help service each other. To help each other, to love each other, respect each other as friends, neighbors, etc.、Um, it just puts things into perspective that you know we all have a certain purpose. Maybe we don't have it right. We not, don't find it right now. Maybe our purpose is not again as grandiose as some people aspire to be. Some people aspire to be CEOs, lawmakers, legislators, or you know. A community leaders, but not everybody needs to be that. I think we all contribute in our small ways.、Um, we have ways of adding、um, influence and value into the people that are, are immediately around us, right?、Um, maybe our family, you know,、uh, my, like my own sisters. I, you know, I lean on them and they lean on me. My friends.、Uh, My colleagues,、um, and you know,、uh, we 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 all have ways of influencing and spreading positivity and spirituality and good energy all throughout with the people around us.、Um, it doesn't always have to be something big.、Um, I think this whole mindset of all or nothing. <laughs> Um, and linking that to our our personal value, I think it's kind of a sad thing to a sad existence to live, isn't that? Like if we can't don't or we don't make it to those goals, or if we don't become the CEO CEO COOs or、uh, lawmakers, etc., doctors, nurses, blah blah blah, we are nothing. I I don't agree with that. You know, I think sometimes you know if you know. But I'm gonna have a bad day, and a person who's just picking up garbage is giving, talking, saying hi, how you're doing. I appreciate it. I think that would definitely make my day. Um, it, it's just the small acts of kindness also has a very big effect, and God has a has a way of you know letting you know and reminding you about that, especially during. The tougher times, like he knows.、Um, but you have to open your arms and let him in. So I mean, some folks may not really care for that type of speech, but if you're not thinking in those lines, just simply think that the person is just being really nice, and it's kind of nice. It makes me realize that I want to be nice to other people、um, because of the effect it has on me. I want to spread that. 
tenfold to other people, um, I would just do that. Um, and be, and, and remember at the end of the day, being kind is not being nice. Uh, sometimes honesty is very much well warranted. Um, and, you know, people at the end of the day, uh, regardless of how hurt they are the, at the moment, they will appreciate the honesty and transparency um, later on down the road. Like, you did me a favor by telling me um, the truth. And I appreciate that. And I can go back and really think about that moment. But it's something that's out of deceit. Um, yeah, I don't think I have appreciation or if I, if I can actually forgive an action like that, then that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. So, yeah, my heart goes out to that girl. I hope God, you know, works his power in you and helps you recover from your heartbreak and definitely seek help doesn't necessarily if you're not into the spirituality thing although i you know personally i think it's very fulfilling um get psychological help if you have friends you can talk to um, i'm assuming it's probably a hard issue to talk to your friends about perhaps which is why you did it on tiktok um you know, maybe you wanted some affirmation from commenters or bypassers who watch the content or anything like that. So maybe, I don't know. But I do hope um, you get through this tough time. And uh, remember, you know, um, we have to, we do have to learn to respect and love ourselves, build those healthy boundaries in order for us to find the right person. So it's okay to be alone. You don't need a relationship right now. Just work on yourself. Find, find the things that make you happy. And with that with time, if it's meant to be, you will find your person. So that's my three part video. Um, just want to get it out there. I mean, I have all those, I have actually recorded videos before, but I think they're a little too um, uh, I wouldn't say conflicting, but it's definitely controversial stuff um, about the political state of the country. So I think I'm going to reserve that for a different video because I could totally go into an angry rant about how the state of things that are happening in this country is not in the favor of the, the citizens that are living here. Um, and yeah, it's the decline of the empire, right? So, yeah. Uh, but I wish everyone well. I wish everyone a blessed weekend, happy and restful weekend. If you need to take that time for yourself to take care of yourself. And um, hopefully another video soon. I don't know when, but soon enough.